dark even, I'm confused, it's really empty. The pictures you saw gave evidence, something like hope, hope that is laying unseen, buried, non-existent. But here it is again, something stepping up again, a spike in your wishing, your wish to see something, to see the pictures or hear the voices. You go out to an isolated place, deserted, a place that belongs to itself, a hill, a small hill, trees in the sun, and you're sitting there, not quite meditative, and certainly not prayerful, but waiting for it to come, not knowing what, not even who, but anticipating. You go there several days in a row, and by now you're receptive, you're anticipating, what should it be? starts. It creeps up the nape of your neck. There's a flooding in the chest, a swelling. But it comes out through the eyes. And the blindness drops away. You can see it. It's never what you expect. You never wanted this kind of thing to happen. But you have the ability and the fact that it should happen. It's always too frightening or too ridiculous. And you can never tell your friends about it. So you sit there and the pictures come giving you some idea of what to do, not to do, upsetting you into action or not, or they don't make any sense at all until you're in the nursing home or on your deathbed. Still they flow, little videos showing you possibilities. They're winsome, bloody, indispensable, universal, unreliable, dire, and superfluous. But they tell you a little something, a very little something, but something enough. They manage to tell you a piece of what you need to know, sort of, and you take it in. There's no room for anything else. No room for the outside. Just the pictures making their impressions. And you, receiving what comes through. You're more patient these days, and somewhat more mature. So is it any better, any clearer? The picture's the same. Perspective. You sit there ten years later, hoping for a new set, for a new piece of instruction. But you don't care if it's revelatory or even instructive. You just want to see them again. You want to be assured by them. Pictures from the past. You see the old pictures rising and fading. They do assure and in some way unsettle. What you see is sharper than ever, even if you saw the same thing ten years ago new pictures now, never before seen, and as usual, too much to behold. But try to take them, try. White hot pictures reveal a possible future. Your chest is hot, radiant, you burn. The new pictures capture you. They make a sort of sense with the old pictures, but not all together. Then the pictures fade away, and it's all you can take. They're gone quickly. The day has passed. You're soaked. Watched so gloriously by the possibilities. Also dumbfounded. Terrified. You let a few days pass before you stoop to anything like interpretation. Who cares? It doesn't matter if they don't reveal. It matters that they're there. See it.